I'm Angelica Nebbia, Senior Web Editor of Flex Magazine, and I'm here with the Chairman of the NPC Northeast, Head Judge of the MPC and IFBB, and owner of Bev Francis Powerhouse Gym, Mr. Steve Weinberger. I'd like to go through the men's open bodybuilding competitor list alphabetically, discussing each one, and then we'll save the reigning champ, six-time Mr. Olympia Phil Heath, for last. Next up, we've got Gerald Williams. Now, Gerald's going to be making his Olympia debut this year. He only earned his pro status at the 2015 North Americans, and he's been placing pretty much top 10 ever since. Most recently, he won the 2017 California Pro in May, which is how he qualified to come to the 2017 Olympia. The thing is, when he won that show, he was not competing against guys at the same caliber that he's going to be up against on the Olympia stage. So what are the realistic expectations for a guy like Gerald going on to the Olympia stage for the very first time? This is his first time on a big stage. You just went from being on a baseball team to playing in the World Series. This is the ultimate. If he can get into that top 15, it's a win. Ruli Winkler. Now, Ruli is one of the biggest guys every time he steps on stage. He's right up there as far as mass goes with Big Rami. We've seen him have some issues with stomach distension in the past, but it seems like he's gotten a pretty good handle on that. Ruli's also one of the few guys who can pull off a backflip on stage. And seeing a guy that size do something like that is pretty incredible. Now, Ruli's competed a lot of times with his best placement being at the Olympia last year when he placed sixth. He then went on to qualify for this year's Olympia by winning the Sheru Classic in Dubai. Do you think Ruli can beat last year's placement and crack the top five against this year's lineup? Hopefully he doesn't come in too big, because like you say, when he comes in too big, he has a problem with his stomach. He brings his size, not even down a little bit, but just enough where he can control his stomach. And once again, because he is so big and thick, especially in the shoulders and the chest, and his back is very thick, but he could use a little more width because he is so thick. So if he brings that back up to match that thickness, he could definitely do it. Last but not least, in the men's open bodybuilding lineup is the reigning and six-time Mr. Olympia, Phil Gift Heath. This year, Phil's going to be competing for his seventh Olympia title, which if he wins, is going to tie him with bodybuilding legend Arnold Schwarzenegger. Now, Phil is really active on social media, very interactive with his fans, especially on his new series called Chasing Arnold on Collide. He makes it really apparent that he's determined to win this seventh title. Phil's always determined, but this year it seems more than ever. As far as complete packages go, is it easy to expect another win from Phil Heath? Phil could beat Phil. If Phil is on and right on the money, some years he is, some years he's not. If he's a little off, he could be beaten. If he's not off, anybody could be beaten. But if he's on, he's very hard to beat. So in your opinion, what has to happen this year for one of the other athletes to claim the Mr. Olympia title? They gotta knock him out. I mean, and honestly, if he's off, which there have been times when he's won, he still deserves to win, but he wasn't at Phil's best. At Phil's best, he's very hard to beat. 